All right, guys, what's going on? This is Brother Kane and Sparrow's Way for Games. And if you guys remember, the last video we finished off levels four through six. Apparently, we've had a hard time with levels, not levels, yeah, well, not level six, but race six is what I meant to say. So it took about, I'd say, about three tries to finally get it right. So. Um, that's what I'm going to start doing from here on out for this. I'm going to start putting them in parts. So I'll do, right now, I'm going to do race 1, 2, and 3. And then the next part will have 4, 5, and 6. And then, let me see how many we got. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Alright, so I will try to do at least maybe 1 through 3, 4 through 6, and then 7 and 8. So let's do it like that. So that way it's easier on everybody. So, race 1. Let's play for first prize we get 850 bucks let's do it we got a bat we got something to use at least come here so we still have uh we, we're still finishing up our well not finishing up but more so still working on our cosplay suit for kane oh snap yeah we're still working on our cosplay suit for kane the inverted suit that he wore back in 99 and 2000 we're still working on that, so it's going to be very exciting to see how that's going to play out. Um, like I just bought some more um, fabric spray paint and acrylic paint to kind of start working on the suit, so I can kind of give you guys the info on exactly how I do it. Um, if you guys want me to wait until I finish it, that's fine too as well. Um, I could also, like I said, I could also let you guys know ahead of time of how I'm doing it. So, for those who want to know exactly how the inverted cane suit is made, for those who are possibly wanting to do another cane suit instead of the original 1997 suit, um, I would definitely advise that you get some, like I said, spray paint, at least some uh, tulip spray paint, and I'll... Um, I'll do also do a video because I know some of you guys might not know exactly what I'm talking about, but I would definitely say go ahead and get you some tulip fabric spray paint. Um, you'll definitely need black and red. Now, depending on how you do it, I would say you're gonna need more black, obviously for the whole suit because you're changing the whole suit from red to black to black to red. So the jagged edges you'll need to make red. So instead of spray painting that. Um, I decided to use acrylic paint and start um, using that to spray it. So we got first place. We got $850. So our funds are now $1,850. So now we are on the second race, the bridge toll. So, like I said, I'll show you guys at some point for sure exactly how I do it. Um, I'm actually going to wait for my suit to get here in order to do that. So I'll probably just do that then. But like I said, I use folk art. And the color is lipstick red. There is apple red. So I would definitely say it's your choice of red paint that you want to use. You can use apple red. You can use lipstick red. Whichever one works good for you. I didn't really know exactly which one to get. So I just got one. And lipstick red seems to definitely match exactly the suit. Now if you're looking for the pink. Oh god. I gotta get away from Brady. He's gonna arrest me. What's that man? Out of here. But, um, like I said, you, it's your choice on whatever color you want to use. I'm still working on that. And then I'm actually trying to work on another suit as well afterwards. So kind of being the busy person and then getting set and ready for Halloween as well because I know it's like another month away um, what I would like to do is maybe do um, I'd like to try to do a whole October fest of just scary stuff so if you guys are up for it I'm more than welcome to do that with you guys because I would love to do that come here out of my way. Um, I would love to do that. Uh, we can still go and um, what's the word? We can still go and look up more horror stuff. Maybe 
work on something good too as well. Um, like I said, we're going to probably do that. If you guys are up for it, we are going to probably go back and do the states again. Of all the most horror stuff you could probably find there. So I'd, uh, I would hope that you guys would like for me to do that. Because I would like to do that for all of October. And I'm still working on my Nighty Night Clown story. So um, that's still going good. I'm getting getting there to being finished. I'm about maybe halfway at this point right now. So I'm very excited for that. I'm still continuing to work on it. So we got first place again, so we get $890, with the $40 obviously being the combat bonus. So we got $2,740. So now we are ready for the final race. You know what? Depending on how this one goes, I might do the fourth one, actually. I might do the fourth one. But let's do it. See if we can find some other weapons. Out of my way, Bruce. So that's that right there. I don't need that because I'm at full. But, um. What was I about to say? Depending on how this. Two, depending on how this costume goes, I might do TikTok, possibly. Might. That's the key word is might. It ain't guaranteed I might. Ow, quick Nick. He just beat me down. I just didn't want to get busted by the cop. I'm not, I can't have that happen. But, um, depending on how that goes, I might start TikTok and just do my cane cosplays on there too as well. At least that way it has more, it has more effects. And what I mean by effects is more, um, I guess variations of what you can do like with backgrounds and stuff like that to whereas YouTube you kinda have to have certain software come on cop yeah that's about that you're not over here you ain't over here first place again alright see so yeah we got we got a lot of time so we're gonna go ahead and someone just knocked me off my bike great Alright, so, with that, we're going to go ahead and jump straight to the fourth, because obviously, you know, we got a lot more time on our hands, so we're going to go ahead and start this race, the Tunnel of Love. See what they have down here. Um, updates on Comic-Cons, so... There was one I was going to go in Hickory, but uh, my friend and I weren't wanting to go. Only because of his friend actually not really being one to be a good influence to be around. So it kind of, it's more of those, you get bad vibes around that person type thing. So you don't want to be around them. So that's kind of what he told me. So I respect his decision. Lost here. Gotta get back on the road. Gotta get back on the road. Get back on the road. Get back on the road. There you go. Everyone's already bypassing me. Literally. Or literally passing by me. More so. Alrighty. We're back to where we need to be. Um, on that note, actually, I'm actually excited to do Gauntlet Legends. I don't know if you guys know exactly what that is, but for those who don't know it's more of like a D&D &D adventure, adventure type game you you gotta be oh my god oh my god oh my god I got I'm so mad right now I had the guy I only got $40 in a can of soda warm I don't want that you can take it back I don't want it all right Let's see if we can do it again. Out of my way, Bruce. 
But yeah, I'm very excited to do <clears throat> Gotland Legends, and like I said, for those who don't know what it is, it's a somewhat D&D &D adventure type game. So basically what you're doing is you're finding gold. <clears throat> you're finding gold, you're beating up goblins, trying to level up, and obviously get new powers that you could use. I think for like a duration of time, that's the only bad part. It's like a duration of time you have to use it, and then it goes away, and then you have to go and hope to find another somewhere. So, um, another thing also is, I'm sorry, I'm kind of paying attention to this, but then also trying to talk at the same time. So, obviously, like I said, with that, you're trying to level up. And with leveling up, you're also trying to find obelisks. Which, for those who don't know what that is, it's, um, uh, it's kind of hard to explain what, basically, what it is. But, um, it, it kind of seems like a mat, well, I don't want to say magical type of thing. Sort of, kind of. Yeah, 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 second place. That works. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of difficult to exactly explain what that is, but you're mainly trying to find 13 ruins in order to put this demonic demon known as Scorn back to where he was in the underworld, trying to send him back down there. So, that's kind of how that works out, but we'll explain later. But other than that, um, that concludes this, so I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Brother Kane and Sp Sparrow's Way for Games. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at SparrowsW4G, or Sparrows underscore W4G on Instagram, and follow me on YouTube, obviously here on Brother Kane. Make sure you guys click the like button if you like what you see, and we'll continue doing more of this. We're all still going to be doing wrestling too. So, we'll see you guys in the next video.